central leadership, you know, blanket for for everybody here, I think would be somewhat appreciated in a time like this, right? I, th- I think a lot of people yeah. would be like, okay, we understand that. At least we know where we're going instead of having to wait on this and make different decisions. <laughs> the NCAA has fumbled the bag this entire yeah. time. But when, while the NCAA gets gets a lot of rap for things that they do, I or think don't it, do. In this case, I don't think you, you they should be blamed for this because you can't come out with a, an umbrella directive that affects a, a school on the East Coast versus a school in the Midwest and a school in the, in the West Coast. And and to say they dropped the ball, I, I think that's totally unfair. No, 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 no. Because no, they not. don't do this. It's not fair. I mean, it is fair to say that. How could you say that? The, the, not, not for just How this. How in the world could you say not, that not about just people this. who run the athletics countrywide yeah. are learned like like Hargis, like uh, Holder, like the people who have been in this business five times longer than you've been born, and you're going to tell me they don't know what they're doing? With everything that has gone on and their response to everything, with the pandemic and everything else, has their, their response has been absolutely terrible. And how would you – give me an example. Everybody, what do you mean? Well, Everybody else has this entire terrible. time. The NCAA coming out with no, no recommendations for anything until the last second, and when they do, it doesn't help anybody. It's everything that everybody knows. They're, they're like for instance, they just talked about with the uh, the football recommendations that the guidelines they put out what like two weeks ago yeah, now, now, yeah. and it was the same thing that everyone's already been doing. No one like that and everything else. Their response: There's been Mark Emmert has done nothing. There's been no response. Well, how from would him. you have done it different? You're you're now the head of the NCAA. What would Patrick? Wheeler I would have, have done come different? out and first of all, I would have made more appearances publicly, right? I would what have has actually, that got to do with anything? What would you have done? When people want leadership, part of it is saying where are we in this process? When Mark Emmert waits months before he comes out and says something, that's an issue. With everything right now, right? We talked about this all over the place. That if you have a central figure of leadership, one of their jobs is to come out and let you know where everything is right now, where they stand. We barely got that this entire time with the NCAA. And I'm just going to go back real quick before, because I know you're, you're railing on us. But keep in mind, back in, in, in April, during we, we always forget, while Gundy, you know, during his uh, uh, press conference that, that made national waves, he also made the comment, we need to know, whether it's from the conference or the NCAA, we need to know what's going on and nothing's being done. Even he was upset back then, the fact that there was no direction. I think he was taking a shot. Gundy was at his conference more than he was anything. Oh, he, said, he said both. He said both. I, I don't think he was absolving his conference. Though. I mean, because Bowlesby has given 86 different versions of what could happen since he started coming out and making appearances, which would make you well, happy. Well, at least he did. But I could make all those options and be no more precise than he is. At least he actually w- had, came out and said that there were of all these options, we're going to pick one of them, right? There's one here that we're going to decide on, and here's and I give credit to Bob Bowlesby this entire time because yeah, he laid out a bunch of different options, but he did always say like make everyone know this is where we're at with this. We're going to be voting at this time. We're going to have a meeting this time about this. All these options are on the table. That was ten times more than anything the NCAA has done this entire time over all this. And I, who, who does Emmert work for? I, I know, I know. Tell me I, who he works no, for. I know who he works for. I get that okay. this is all. I know that this is all an unprecedented situation. People blame it on that. Like he didn't know what the response was. But when you are the head of the NCAA, you have to be ready to face this type of situation and actually help your universities out a little bit here. And he didn't. When did he help the, the universities out at all during all of this? I think it's up to the universities and the conferences to help themselves out. Then, what, then, then what's the That's NCAA for? Yeah. Well, tell me what it's for. Why is it here? Because all you who want no NCAA and you want the Power Fives to get together, I've said this a hundred times, you get the Power Fives together, everybody gets together, Alabama, Oklahoma still call the shots and you don't. So what's the difference? The difference is we'd at least have some leadership. I mean, I've heard this leadership crap all more than I want to hear. He works, Emmett works for the entire NCAA Board of Governors, all the presidents. Yeah. He works for those people. If they don't give him the direction, how can he come out and say anything unless while they're waffling around trying to figure out where they're going? It's communication, different. communication across the country, NCAA, individual universities has been awful during this time. Agreed. And I think that's what he's trying to say. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll go that route. It's if exactly you want to what include I said. everybody, but. The problem with the communications that you guys bring up doesn't just stem from Emmert. It doesn't just stem from the NCAA Board of Governors. They don't have the, – the individual conferences can't tell you what they're doing. 
So, so, so Mark Emmer didn't get any information from anybody at this time that was worth sharing? Is that what you're saying? Well, if he didn't think it was worth sharing, then he didn't share it. I, I find that hard to believe. That why would, he, that it why would you come out like Bowlesby every other day of a week and tell you, well, we might do this one. Oh, we might do this one. I mean, do you feel that much better that he gave you six options that we might do? Do you feel better than uh, that? Yeah, because I was actually in tune with what was possibly on the table. That was nice to know. Well, did it take a genius to figure out? You're either going to play or you're not playing. You're either going to no. play 12 games or you're going to play it 10 or 9. It wasn't that simple. It was like you just said, we play or not play. It wasn't that simple. There were all these different ways oh, that yeah. we're going to go about it. Right? Are we going to start early? Right. Are we going to start on time? Right. Are we going to start in the spring? The only are we going to start in the fall in the spring? never did say was we're not playing. That's the only thing he never did say. He never uttered those words, we're never going to play football. He didn't say that. Everything else, though, he's thrown out there and stuck on the wall. So if you felt good about every other week changing your stance on what he says, then I guess you didn't like what was still going on. But I don't think anybody within this this whole ma- – you know, there's a lot of experts in this room, but I'm just telling you how you would have done it to go up and get on these people for not being able to be forthright for you. What would you have done? Tom, it's not just for me. It's for everybody. I'm not for the only – For everybody. Who else? I, have you not paid attention to everyone in the media? I don't pay attention to Twitter World, so I don't care if it's not people Twitter. on Twitter World care. Go that, on any sports me. network. Everybody will say the same thing. There has been a lackluster response from the NCAA this entire time.